Welcome back to the P count. Wow, look at that leaderboard. It's tighter than something that's died. 10 years ago, dirt would have made a much better joke. Can Lucky hold on? Or will someone come from nowhere and grab Stevie by the hand and say, come home with me, big boy? Strap in and strap on, as this is going to be as exciting as watching Fluff Bat. The ones hosted Templeton in a must-win game to fight off relegation. Isaac brought up his maiden ones half century. Brilliance from Dave Mooney. BT was stalking his prey. Nah, mate. After last week's close win, the seconds were on the other end of the stick in round 11 against North Ringwood. Hefo tested the limits of the frog box stats in his first over. Shit even Harry got a run. Jeez how did they lose from this position? Okay well that might be why. Another running the first one hard lesson for Das Hole. And with eight needed off three balls, it came to a sad and weird end. Out of threes. What have you got for us this time? A thumping at the hands of Heath Monwood. Well, I'm glad there's no footage. What's that? It's on frog box. This will be good. With the opposition off to a flyer, not having lost a wicket, Bailey needed some inspiration. He looked around the field at his team of deadbeats and saw Russian. He's the man. He'll show us the way with an unplayable delivery. In he came, all fired up. Ready to take the game by the scruff of the neck and choke the shit out of it. Well it was unplayable. Okay Rush, that was a loosener. Come on give us something. Here we go big fella get us going. Okay Coco, you're on son. Show us all how it's done. For fuck's sake. Foxy and Roscoe spun a couple of wickets each. But 230 was going to be a tough chase. Which didn't start well after Brando triggered Tate. Then some guy bowling poo in a cap ran through us, and it only got worse. I don't know what this is, but it's Premier Cricket apparently. The fourth season was threatening to derail without dirt. Another loss he and Johnny was getting missed calls from Drew and Rowan. 
The Fives had an easy win here. All old blokes doing stuff. Seriously, have the kids done anything in the lower grades this season? I don't know why we waste our time pretending to like them. Prana's piss heads rocked up to Rangers, and we were blessed that Oscar showed up this time. Dirt set the tone smashing a girl for six, and then in true Dirt style got out to her next ball. Some stuff happened that wasn't captured, with Klossy hitting a stylish 50, and Richo chipping in with some. Max Gidley then went out to face the last ball and was told to hit a six, but has been watching too much of fluff batting. Brucey got a bit too excited. The Sevens took on another version of Croydon, and there's plenty of great footage from this game. But Dirt doesn't want to be suspended again, so I'll keep this short. Here's Drew smashing his way to 40 red. Okay, I think I'm safe. The girls hosted St. Andrews at home. Rach got her top score and Andrea tried out a new trick from coach Woody. The reverse sweep. Worked for a boundary, thanks Woody. Round 11. <laughs> 